Hello everyone, welcome to this new video where we are going to solve this equation. First of all, I would like to thank you for all your comments and suggestions. Please like the video and subscribe to the channel. Thank you. So we can see that this equation is, is well defined if x is not equal to one half. So the domain of this equation is as minus one half because we can see that if x is equal to one half here we'll have something which is not defined so that's the reason why the domain is equal to this okay so let's just let's just solve our equation Let's just rewrite our equation in this form. We have exponential 2x divided by 2x minus 1 power 3, which is again, which is again 2 times 3, which gives 6, as we had here. This 6, okay. So we can just write it this way. Now minus 2, sorry, minus 2 exponential. We'll do the same thing, which is 4x, which will become 2x squared. So we have, so we'll have exponential 2x divided by 2x minus 1 squared minus exponential 2x divided by 2x minus 1 plus 2 equal to 0. So we have this equation now. We can see that we have the same terms here. Exponential this, exponential this, and exponential this one. So we can rewrite it as If we choose our y be equal to exponential 2 power x divided by 2x minus 1, we can rewrite our equation as y u minus 2 y square minus y plus 2 equal to zero. This is just simply by replacing this value with y inside this equation here. We obtain exactly this equation. Okay. Now we need to solve. What we need to do is to solve this equation. Is to solve this equation and then find the value of y and come and replace it here sorry and come and replace it inside this equation and find the corresponding value of x is okay let's just do it now okay we are going to solve this equation we can see that we can rewrite our equation as y cube minus this y here now minus 2 y square here now plus 2 equal to 0 okay we have this inside this one we can put y outside so we will have here y outside of y square minus 1 here we do the same thing we have 2 here and 2 here we can put the two outside so we'll have here minus two times y square minus one which is equal to zero so this is what our equation becomes now what we can still do is that we can expand this one and see 
okay no need to expand what we can do is that we have the same terms here and the same terms here you can just put it outside and we'll have y square minus one times it will stay here with this y and this minus okay times y minus two equal to zero and this is more simple in this way so now we can see directly that we have this y if you expand this one this one will be y minus one times y plus one times this one which is y minus two equal to zero okay here this last equation means that our y is equal to one or y equal to minus one or y equal to two okay now we can see that we cannot choose this value of y we cannot choose this one because our y was equal to because this is our y and the exponential 2x divided by 2x minus 1 which is greater than 0 so this negative value of y cannot be chosen so we'll just forget about this value and consider only this one and this one so we stay with we'll just continue with y equal to 1 or uh, y equal to 2 okay now if we come and replace this value of y inside this one and this one this will become exponential 2x divided by 2x minus 1 equal to 1 our exponential 2x divided by 2x minus 1 equal to 2 okay now we'll solve these two equation and find the corresponding value of x is okay now the first one we know that uh, these are positive terms, so we can just put ln function. Let me call this one the first equation and this one the second equation. Okay, the first equation, if I consider first the first equation, I will have exponential 2 power x divided by 2x minus 1 equal to 1. So if I put ln on both sides, I will have ln of exponential 2x divided by 2x minus 1 equal to ln of 1, which is just the log function. Okay. So we know that ln exponential of something is equal to that thing. So let me recall the property here. If we have ln of exponential a, then this is equal to a okay so it will just be equal to this value here so we'll have an ln of zero or ln of one is equal to zero so we'll just have here 2x divided by 2x minus one is equal to zero and this means that we have 2x is equal to zero because if this one comes here it will be multiplied with zero so which is zero so this means that x is equal to zero for the first equation now if you consider the second the second equation if you consider the second equation here we will have the second equation 
you'll have exponential 2x divided by 2 power x minus 1 equal to 2. So if we solve this, if we solve this using ln on both sides, we'll have here ln of exponential 2x divided by 2x minus 1 is equal to ln of 2. Okay, this is simply meaning that 2x divided by 2x minus 1 is equal to ln of 2. Okay, and this means that we have 2x which is equal to 2x ln of 2 minus ln of 2. We have this. This means that we have x which is equal to minus minus ln of 2 divided by 2 minus 2 ln of 2. Okay, so finally our x is equal to 1 half minus ln of 2 divided by 2 for the second equation. So finally we'll have the solution of our equation which is the first solution and the second solution. So finally we'll have the solution which is a 0 for the first and 1 half minus ln of 2 divided by 2 for the second case. So these are the solutions of our equation which was this one with which was exponential exponential 6x divided by 2x minus 1 minus 2 exponential 4x divided by 2x minus 1 minus exponential 2x divided by 2x minus 1 minus 2 sorry plus 2 equal to 0 so thank you for watching the video like the video and subscribe to the channel thank you